Yeah, I stopped and it started again, so it won't cut off on us. You know, I think it had like a 25, 30 minute limit. Go ahead, I kind of NLT version of uh, Ezekiel 35 and 5. Mm -hmm. It says, Your eternal hatred mm -hmm. for the people of Israel led you to butcher them when they were helpless. See, that led you to butcher them when they were helpless. Here it is, you're ruling, but still, you're butchering the people that are helpless. All right? That's pure hatred. Go ahead. It says, When I had already punished them for their sins. See? The Lord already punished us for our sins. But guess what? The, even the scripture says you have forwarded their affliction. Yeah. You went overboard with your rulership. All right? Yeah. Every every yep. time Jake tried to get ahead, they come up with something new to, 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 to push Jake back down. Yep. Because I, And I mentioned, um, what was it? Uh, COINTEL PRO. They say that that doesn't exist anymore. They've done away with that. But they, they just call it a new name, new man. Name. Yep. You know, they do it under a different guise. So, they, they have never let up. They 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 butchering us until the end. They the the, the um the prison population have done nothing but rise yes. over over the last twenty years, man. And they even talked about dealing with the prison industry. They even talked about what? The music. Alright? Giving these rappers all this money to what? Promote death to our people. Alright, which in turn will have them locked up and what? Give more to that slave labor. Bone Thugs and Harmony members like even brought that out. That, that what? They have an agreement with these rappers to pump that music because they did studies showing that the majority of those cats that go to jail, they've been listening to that demonic music. That's evil for your ass on the left hand side that they're able to do studies like that. Okay? They're willing to do studies like that, promote that music and those vibes to put you, Jake, in jail for what? Uh, uh, basically, practically free slave uh, labor. And what they do. They give you like pennies because you know they pay the prisoners very, very, very little. They give you pennies because in their mind they're saying we got to give them something because if they do completely free work, that'll be actually slavery. Yeah. All right? They give them like 15 cents. Yeah. An hour. Yeah. For a day. No. And um, you had your, all these people went out and voted for it, but that was something that uh, Hillary Clinton. She used that in her while they was in office, man. That that cheap uh, prison labor, man. Yup. You yep. know. Yup. Bill Clinton, uh, 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 Joe Biden. You see, mandatory minimums. They wanted Jake to go to jail so they can get that uh, cheap slave labor, which is basically slavery again. You pay people ten cent a day, fifteen cent a day, and stuff like that. And guess what? The the products that those uh, uh, cats in jail make. Guess what? They have uh, uh, government contracts, and they tell the government to buy product from those sites. That lets you know it's a lucrative business. All right, go ahead, bro. That's all I had on that. Yep. But yeah, I just wanted to bring that out. You know, the whole presumption of guilt and convict leasing. Okay. How they, you know, they want what to have Jake and the law state and to be wrapped up in the system. They want to keep us to what from being a nation. And they're following the same thing oh, yeah, that, that what? They followed the same thing that what? Other heathen did in the past. There's nothing new under the sun, man. Mm -hmm. All right? But you, you go, yeah, you're going to close out with Psalms 83. All right? Sennacherib, Sennacherib and them wanted what? To there not to be a revolt or rebellion. Esau wants us to not stand up and revolt and for it to be a rebellion, okay? And they came up with their different laws to try to keep us down. No new thing under the sun. It's yeah, just like Exodus, man. They dealt uh, craftily with us. Man. Yes. You know, yes. Once, once they thought we was about to rise. And rise that's up. why yep. it was at one point, if you actually look it up, the, the population, I'll just go on, the so-called blacks population was rising steadily. Mm -hmm. And then it just started halting at like 12, 13 percent. Mm -hmm. Cause they, cause of their uh, uh, cunningness. That's right. This that's is right. so, this is Psalm 83, verse 2, it says, For lo, thy enemies make a tumult, mm -hmm. and they that hate thee have lifted up the head. Uh -huh. They have taken crafty counsel against thy people, and consulted against thy hidden ones. Uh -huh. They have said, Come and let us cut them off from being a nation, that the name of Israel may be no more in remembrance. And the name of Israel, he is a prince of God, by the way. We are the new black no more party. in remembrance. Read it we again. It says, they have taken see, see this, this, this is a part of that system. Yeah. To keep us from being a nation. Yeah. 
All right. We are the nuclear panther party. See, Black, Pan Black Pantherism is not a nation. Yeah. We are here, and you better it get says, used to us. My they have taken crafty counsel against thy people and consulted against thy hidden ones. Uh -huh. They don't even know that they were set See up too. They don't even know why they're being called you know black. Huh? Read, it Read it again. Read it again. Read it again, huh? Okay, okay. He's responding to us. We yeah. said, yeah. All right, well, that's the division. No, it is. You know? Read it again, huh? It said they have taken crafty counsel. Psalm eighty-three, three. They have taken crafty counsel against thy people. Because you gotta understand, they they tweak the history books. They they've risen us up. What the number one person, the number one nation. All right, one of our downfalls, Esau. Who do you think brought up African American studies? It was the Edomite. It was the Edomite that brought up African American studies. And they only went back, but so far. How come they only go back to 1865 or 1863? How come they don't go back prior to that, all right, where they took us from while we was in slavery? The western coasts of Africa. What about prior to that, before we got to the western parts of Africa? All right, they don't teach them that. Why? Because they want us to stop being a nation, man. All right? He what do you say? And, that, and, and that's yeah. going to destroy. See? Yeah. That's what they want. They want you to grab their guns so they can mow you down. Yeah? Because Esau knows that that's his blessing. See? Look at talking about his neighborhood. This is Esau's block. They own this. Go here, bro. Huh? Look at this guy. Yeah. Look at that guy. See? It's a lick of salam and it goes back to uh, Islam. <laughs> Look at that guy, man. Come on. This is 2 Corinthians uh, 6, verse 3. Yeah. It says, yeah, see that? That's the spirit. Nah, we, we, see? Get in with that. Yeah. Go ahead. And they were already. I want to speak to y'all when I say something, though. Yep. Giving no offense in anything that the ministry be not but what, but, hey, brother, but Hey, brother, what they don't understand that there's a heavenly father that we need to serve, man. That's the reason. Hey, the reason, hey, brother, the reason why we went to slavery, because we pissed the heavenly father off. That's why we went to shackles. That's the reason for it, man. Go here. They already been infiltrated. Yeah, exactly. You know? This is why I read it again. It says 2 Corinthians 6, verse 3 says, Give me no offense in anything that the ministry be not blamed. What they want, what the enemy wants, is for you to gather guns so they can yeah. easily have an excuse to get And mow you down. You know? And you ain't gonna fight him with his own blessing, man. Yup. You know? He's gonna easily destroy you if it comes to guns. Yeah. You know? Now nobody Damn. says. Hey, spirit, hey, hey, I'll give me spirits over here, right. man. Spirits. We can't finish what you were yeah, saying. Yeah, nobody's saying that you can't, you know, uh, train yourself, but to try to put that on an open forefront, you know, you're just doing your people more harm. Yep. You know? That way already fell. The scripture say that if it be a man, it will come, come to naught. Exactly. You know? Exactly. Straight up. So we're going to end up with that. See, yeah. and, and Esau setting up these different dudes to come out there to further confuse us. That's what keeps us from being a nation. Having not the proper knowledge. That's right. When we have the wisdom of Yahweh Shemel Shai, then we are raised up. Nothing else, man. So with that call Haloyim, Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Bashem of Kalkadash, the one the apostles and elders, great most, know the rule and teach well. Peace shalom to the elect. Double shalom.